more sports legends will tee it up on Sunday afternoon as Tiger Woods and Peyton Manning team up, to face Phil Mickelson and Tom Brady at Medalist Golf Club in the match, Champions for Charity. The four icons of their respective sports will be competing in an 18-hole, golf match to raise money to help battle the coronavirus pandemic. Woods and Mickelson are obviously all-time greats on the course, while Manning and Brady, who thrived on a different kind of turf, have golf games that should be able to stand up against the tough test of medalists beginning at 3 p.m. ET The match will air live on TNT and other Turner-owned stations. Let's take a look at what this match means and what Sunday is going to look like as we get live, golf for the second weekend in a row with 28 championships, majors and Super Bowls, represented in this unique foursome. The PGA Tour returns June 11th with action from June 13th to 14th on, CBS How the Match developed the Woods Mickelson Match Play event has a, brief, history. The duo squared off in Las Vegas back, in November 2018 for $9 million. They never really closed the door on running it back after, Mickelson took that iteration, and the cash, in extra holes. The opportunity to play it again and raise some money for, charity during this pandemic presented itself, and they took it. Mickelson addressed this recently on The Dan Patrick Show. Producer. Brian Zurif and I were the ones who came up with the idea, years ago and brought it to Ken and had it developed before we even brought it to Tiger, said Mickelson. He has a very creative mind and thought the interaction between two other players was going to be an important part of improving our match. When Tiger and I came down the stretch in Vegas, we clammed up. We didn't talk. We didn't communicate, we tightened up. That's part of why Brady and Manning are involved, along with their star power, as caddies will not be present so all mic'd up interaction will only be between the four golfers, well, two football players and two golfers. What's at stake? None of the four will walk away with any cash this time. But that doesn't mean there's not a lot on the line. Warner Media and the golfers will collectively make a charitable donation of $10 million to benefit entities such as Direct Relief, the American Red Cross, Save Small Business and the All In Challenge, an initiative provides food to those in need. More money will be raised during the actual event as viewers donate and will have the ability to enter live raffles featuring experiences with all four men at a later date. So the $10 million serves as a baseline for how much will be raised on Sunday with even more than that, expected when everything is said and done. This is different than what Phil and I did two years ago, Woods said. That was he and I just having a great time. Trying to showcase golf in a different way. We're coming together to showcase golf in a different way, but it's about charity. That's the reason why we're all doing this. Match format the event will be match play, and the front nine will be best ball. Here's an example of how that works. If Manny, Brady and Woods all make par no. One but Mickelson makes birdie, the Mickelson-Brady team is one up. Manning and Brady receive one stroke each on no. 3, no. 6 and no. 8 for their handicaps, and that's how the front nine will be played. One wrinkle is a one club challenge on no. 5, a par 4, in which golfers must choose one club to play the entire hole with, including putting. I'm excited about that because it gives us a genuine look at how skilled players like Woods and Mickelson are when faced with adversity. In the point-and-shoot world of professional golf, we often don't get to see the extreme creativity they possess, which a 30-yard chip shot with a 4-iron can disclose. Other challenges include the following on various holes on the course. Hole no. 
3. Long drive challenge hole no. 4. Closest to the hole challenge hole no. 8. Hole in one challenge. 25 million dollars hole no. 12. Closest to the hole challenge hole no. 15. Long drive challenge hole no. 16. Hole in one challenge. 25 million dollars the back nine is where it gets intriguing in terms of the actual competition it's a modified alternate shot format which means that everybody tees off but after that you have to alternate so one golfer's drive will be chosen and then the teammates brady and mickelson for example will alternate shots until they hold out and move on to the next hole Quarterbacks will not be teeing off from the same tee boxes as Woods and Mickelson. Odds Woods and Manning are minus 190, while Mickelson and Brady are plus 170. This is probably the right call as Manning is a bit better than Brady, and Woods, when healthy, is better than Mickelson at this point in their careers, and at every point in their careers. Medalist Course Rundown Medalist is a monster that has, at various, times, ranked among the hardest courses in the country. When architect Bobby Weed renovated the Pete Tai Greg Norman course, he put in place five Tiger Tees, which are used by the pros, like, Woods, that play it as their home course. I can't wait to go to Tiger's place and take him down, Mickelson told Golf Week. Tiger thinks he has a huge advantage playing there because he was insistent that this event is played on his home course despite everyone else wanting to play it elsewhere. That's fine. We'll take it to him and Peyton, there will be no excuses. It's his home course, but Tom and I are going to go down there and put it to them, and we'll make it that every time Tiger shows up at his home course, he'll have a bad memory. This makes the track 7,500 yards, although not for Manning and Brady, and an absolute beast coming home. Here's how Tour Pro Jamie Lovemark describes the 18th hole. A really tough finishing hole that has a D at 520 yards if they choose to use it. There's a touch of a dog leg right, but the wind will be pumping left to right. There's also a steep hill down the left side of the fairway. Guys will be trying to have it start on that hill and fall to the middle. There's mostly water to the right with a few small bunkers. A front left pin could create a lot of action with a slope behind it being usable. Back pins aren't super hard, but the crosswinds make it difficult to get the correct distance, especially with mid irons, which they may have depending on T. Viewing experience this event will be televised everywhere, DNT, DBS, Trude Van, HLN with a pre-match show streaming on Bleacher Report. Commentators include Brian Anderson, Trevor Immelman and Charles Barkley with Amanda Bailiones and Justin Thomas, conducting on-course interviews. There's a lot going on here, and I love that Barkley and JT are involved. Barkley doing anything is amazing, and Thomas will be great on the course with Woods and the other stars. They have a good rapport, and he won't be afraid to take a few shots. If, say, Mickelson can't find a fairway or Woods is legitimately upset with Manning. Prediction I always go with the underdogs in events like these. Last time we saw Woods, he was spraying shots all over the place at Riviera. Country Club on route to a 79 and last 